All right, all right, all right. Welcome back, my regular viewers, listeners, and watchers. And of course, if you have to be here for the very first time, welcome. Before I go any further, my name is Rahul George, India's premier self-hypnosis coach and your personal guide. So today's pod is inspired by life, by the day that was, and by this very moment. So as you would have guessed by now, especially if you are a regular listener, viewer, or of course, watcher, uh, these pods are recorded every single day. And you know this very act of showing up every day and recording every day is something that I think for the longest time I had uh, been struggling with, I had been pushing aside, uh, not wanting to do it. You know, like a lot of us in the past, uh, or maybe even in the present, I, uh, you know, I had, I had, you know, in the past, let, let me talk about myself for a second. In the past, I had, you know, these ideas of doing projects, I would do them for a while, and then I would, you know, drop them, or just let go of them along the way. And uh, while that might have its own um, you know, side effects for me personally. But, um, you know, when you're looking to build a business, when you're looking to be able to help other people find their own path, this is so important that, you know, you're um, building this muscle of being able to show up and be consistent. So this was something that, you know, for the longest time, I can say, Easily over a decade or so, I've been, you know, trying different ways, um, learning different things to be able to hack the mind, uh, hack my mind, so that I would be able to, you know, do things consistently. But somehow, uh, this was one aspect that always seemed to evade me, of course, until now. Uh, why do I say that? One is, of course, you know, I've been able to consistently show up and record videos now for more than a, for more than a year. And to me, that is definitely a sign that there has been some shift in my mindset in the way that I look at, you know, even the act of creating. And I know that I'm standing um, for you as an example that you can do this. Right? It doesn't matter how difficult your past has been. It doesn't matter, uh, you know, how many times you have struggled uh, what's important, and of course, how many times that you failed, but what's important is that if you've decided that you are going to do this and you keep trying, like no matter what, you keep trying, sooner or later, you will come to that point in your life where you're able to find a formula that works for you. Again, why am I saying this? Because I've been on this journey now for literally more than two decades of finding ways to be consistent finding ways to be able to, you know, find the reason to be able to create for you, right? So in, in all this work that I've been doing now, you know, especially as a, as a hypnotherapist, especially as somebody who's also a digital coach uh, like you, and over all these years, um, you know, whenever I tried to, to find reason, whenever I tried to find a purpose, whenever I tried to find my why, um, somehow it wasn't strong enough. So no matter how many times I tried, it would get to a point and then it would just drop off. But of course, now that I know that, you know, there is a reason to show up every day and to be here for you and to hold this space for you, um, I can tell you that even you will definitely find that place. Now, again, you know, it's like today, like I said, the uh, today's topic was literally inspired by this, which is keep going, right? Uh, even on days where things may not work 100%, even on days where you might feel like, you know, I wish I could just, you know, drop it and not do it. Um, for me, I can definitely say uh, in the last one year plus, that feeling has, you know, dissipated to a very, very large extent. And most days I'm able to find the, the reason uh, to show up. Now, you know this, if you've been watching this content around 
the time of it being made, which means maybe in the last you know month, three months, maybe even a year. Uh, it doesn't matter whether you know this gets one like or fifty likes or five thousand likes. Uh, this was something in the past that you know that, that definitely did. Um, even if it didn't bother me, it was definitely a metric that was somewhere in my mind that oh okay, if I'm not getting even a single like or I'm getting a couple of views, maybe this uh, you know what I'm creating isn't valuable enough. But something I have come to recognize is that. In the early phase of anyone's journey, uh, this is bound to happen, right? Until, and of course, you know, uh, whether it is on Facebook, whether it's on YouTube, the algorithm keeps changing. So it's not about the short term, but instead, you know, you deciding that, hey, you know what? I'm going to do this. I'm going to show up. I'm going to, it's like writing a book. I'm going to do the work. And eventually, at some point, things will click. So, you know, if you needed to hear this message, this is why it's flowing through me to you. And um, wish you all the very best on your journey as a digital coach, especially. And, um, you know, if there's any way in which I can help you, definitely reach out and let me know. And of course, as always, remember to live with purpose. I look forward to seeing you in the next uh, daily post, daily pod. And uh, if you'd like me to create content on any particular topic, definitely reach out and let me know. So with this, I will say bye-bye, God bless, and I will see you in the next one. Take care.